Last up on our power sequencing exercises, we're gonna to talk to you a little bit today about power in the upper body. And this is probably the least important one, I would say, just because most of our clients that come in are already pretty good, especially male clients, at producing power in their upper body. That being said, it is very important, and what Alex is gonna talk through is really talking about how we get that last pull through the impact position on the downswing and how our upper body does have a big play in that. Yeah, absolutely. So, when we set up, we've already talked about the legs. We're already here at the top of our swing. We've already transferred our weight, right? We've already engaged our core and started to rotate our hips. Now, what the upper body is gonna do is really allow that body to pull and turn through the shot and generate all that power. So it's the upper body that really closes the deal in terms of power. Now we're gonna talk about generating power in the upper body. Again, we have our medicine ball. Medicine ball is great for a lot of the power exercises we do. Again, any of these power exercises, we're gonna do five reps or less, every reps as powerful as possible. Today we're working on the chest pass. This is a great one to do with partners. So I have Kaylee here to help me out. We're gonna scoot about six, eight feet away from each other. Nice athletic base like we're in our mid iron stance. And all we're gonna do is chest pass that ball as hard as we can. She's gonna catch it, pass it back, load, and explode through. We're trying to generate as much power as we can through the upper body. Just letting that ball go straight ahead. 